guys welcome back to my channel so today I'm going to be sharing with you my blonde hair tips and I hope that you enjoyed this video and learn a thing or two from the um, tips I'm about to give you guys so we'll get right into the video so I relaxed my hair on the 23rd of February I just wanted something different for my 19th birthday and I wanted to change my hair color and I was like why not do blonde I mean blonde is something that I've done before but with um, attachment and I know it's a color that really looks good on like dark skin people so why not try it and I bleached it myself I used um, the blonde brilliance bleach and it was pr it was quite strong on my hair because that was the first time I was bleaching my hair and my hair was due at the time I'm going to insert a pic right here and my hair was due at the time so I was like um it was really tough but I had to choose between relaxing my hair and bleaching my hair and I chose bleaching my hair because I don't know and yeah um I bleached my hair I did it myself at first but then somebody helped me at the end so I used the blonde um brilliance bleach like I said before and so far the product I had to bleach it the, the whole process was just so long like it took me six hours to get my hair bleached or even more I can't really remember but I had to bleach it like three times and it's not even fully bleached as you can see like it has some black and some brown in my hair but I, I, I kind of like how it has different shades of blonde in my hair and as you can see the roots here already turning black because my hair is changing back to the initial color but um yeah that's so far the bleaching was i didn't really care i just did it and i i didn't really think oh my hair is going to cut blah 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 and i got like amazing feedback people were like oh it's beautiful so i will be dyeing my hair again but not this year because it really had a strong effect on my hair now um that is it for bleaching my hair so going to relax in my bleach hair i'm just going to insert like a couple snapchat clips of me relaxing my bleach hair and how i do relax my hair and i'll just give you guys a minute to watch so guys i'm about to relax my hair my bleached hair and i'm i don't know how to feel to be honest because i don't know what the result is going to be i've mixed my relaxer i don't know if you guys can see I've mixed my relaxer. I'm using the olive oil relaxer and I've mixed it. My friend is going to help me because obviously I don't have eyes on my back. So I'm going to ow, going to divide my hair into four. <sighs> Wish me luck guys. I'm relaxing bleach hair. Hmm. <laughs> I say <I'm> searching for <laughs> bleach hair. <laughs> It shouldn't be that serious because that I mean you're you're meant to leave your hair for like a month, two weeks to a month before you bleach it. Sorry, before you relax um your your bleach hair. So mine is up to a month and a day. So yeah. Insert. So guys, um the first step is to um take your moisturizer to prevent it from heat damage, to prevent like your skin from heat damage. And I'm using shea butter. So I'm just going to put that all over my scalp. Like saloons back in Nigeria, they will just rub it all over your whole face. Like you're going to burn. But yeah, I'm just going to put that all over my scalp because I know my skin to burn. Put it everywhere and at the back too. You're gonna hear me run. back is always tricky <sighs> okay so guys I've put my um heat thing my moisturizer on so I'm just going to start by putting I like to relax heat can you see I already have this one here I'm not trying to burn my skin, so I'm going to do it pretty fast and with my hands. I don't like to wear gloves because I feel like they don't give you the full thing. Just going to apply that everywhere because, like, my hair. I'm I'm like a very hairy person. I have hair everywhere. I can't really see much, so. Start off like that. 
take some in my hand and just do it like that oh my god i'm super scared <laughs> uh, so far i don't think it's doing anything I'm trying to be really quick because this is relaxer we're talking about it. I'm not trying to burn my hair. So I did the I divided my hair into four parts as I said and I did the first part of it and I basically just put the relaxer all over it and then divided my hair into sections and I combed like so. Let me show you guys what I did. Took this part And I put. Are you doing it yourself? Yeah, I want to try and do it myself. I put like this. Start from like the edges or the roots rather, and I do it like, like so. Let me see. So when you do that, like I've put it around the edges, I start to like divide it into sections and layer relaxer like so divide it into sections and just put the relaxer inside divide it just as tiny sections as possible does that make sense it's tiny like <laughs> if you see my roots already like black because my hair is changing back it's been a month since i bleached my hair and it's falling out too. Like so. I'm using Snapchat to record this, so forgive me if you can't really see much. And then I comb everything out. That was me um, relaxing my hair and just like the steps used to relax my hair. Um, so I waited like a month for my bleached head to really settle in before I give it, I relaxed it because relaxing and bleaching at the same time is so much chemical. Like it's it's almost too much chemical for your hair and it can burn, it could take all your hair out. So I didn't want to do that to my hair obviously. So I gave it like a month. I checked the internet and it said two weeks to a month. So I just gave it a month. Um, I, re I bleached my hair on the 23rd of February and relaxed it on the 24th of March, which makes it like a month and a day. So, um, yeah, so far it wasn't, I thought all oh, my hair was going to fall out, but, but, but my hair did fall out. My hair fell out, you guys. Like, I don't know, it, I'm not really worried because I know my hair grows back really fast, but it, like, seeing your hair fall out is, is really scary, to be honest. Um, the front parts of my hair, like, you can't see it now because my hair is sleek to the back, but it chopped a huge amount of like my front hair. And my front hair never cuts. It's only my back hair that's like all chopped off, but it cut like a huge amount. It took like a huge amount of my front hair off. Like my hair is so uneven. Like I can't even style it because it's so uneven. But um, it didn't hurt because my hair was so dirty. Like I haven't washed it in a month since I bleached it, obviously. But it didn't burn or nothing like that, but it did take my hair out. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much... <sighs> I don't know. If I would advise that you... If you're relaxing your hair, your bleached hair, I would... I don't know what I would advise you to do, to be honest, but... I don't know, if you're bleaching your hair, just really think about it because you're going to lose a large amount of hair because bleach is really strong. It takes a lot of time to do and I don't think I'm going to do it again till like maybe next year. I don't know, maybe I'll just buy a, a wig and bleach it. But as far as bleaching my hair, I definitely am going to try it again but at a different time when I'm really sure this is what I want to do. But yeah, that's the experience so far. My hair is changing back already and it's been a month. Um, I kind of feel like I'm meant to be blonde. Like I like the blonde hair, I like the different color. And yeah, but I do miss my black hair just a little bit. But yeah, that's pretty much it for my tips and you know, um, the things I use and whatnot. Um, yeah, but my hair has really suffered because I bleached. 
I straightened, I relaxed. That's so much, <laughs> that's so much of my hair. But you guys should see like how it chopped off this sides of my hair. Oh my god. When I was comb when I finished relaxing and I was washing the relaxer off and I was combing I, I felt like my hair coming out of my scalp like literally but yeah it's not too shabby and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll leave all the products I used for my hair in the process in the description or insert pictures insert insert pictures in the video and I hope you guys enjoy.